everyone, it's Sharon from Sharon at Sea Travel, and we are on the Carnival Vista, first cruise back from the U.S., Carnival cruise that is. We're at Guy's Burger Joint today, and we are going to try all their burgers and tell you which one is our favorite. have all five guys burgers here and we are super excited to check them out and do a taste test so we have over here we have the plain Jane we have the straight up we have the pig patty the ringer and the chilius maximus so we are going to check out each one of these, try each one, and we are going to tell you our favorites and what we think about them. All right, Jamie, we're going to start with the plain Jane. So it's as plain as it gets there. That's right. It, just, a, just, just a burger and burger cheese. Burger and cheese, fun. Now, you can put a little ketchup or some other well, condiments on it, but we're doing it just strictly yeah. with what comes on it for this test. Let's let people know. Huh? Thank you, dude. Oh, um, let's make sure that you guys are aware that there is a huge toppings bar. You can put onions, mushrooms, bacon, um, uh, little taters, um, jalapeno. I mean, they got everything you want. A ketchup mayo. You can put anything extra on these burgers you want. But right now, what we're doing is we're just trying them straight off the grill, straight from the guys at Guys Burger. No extra stuff on them. And we're going to tell you what we think of each one and how we like them. And you're going to find out what Sharon at C's right. favorite Guys Burger is right now. All right, take a bite of that plain, smells good. plain right, Jane. There's nothing on there but cheese and a burger. Uh -huh. These buns are these. These are some bigger buns than we're used to seeing on the guys' burgers. They are. The burgers are actually bigger too. To fit the buns. Mm. Mm. That's a good burger. If I had that burger at a barbecue at my buddy's house, I'd be very happy, mm -hmm. and I would high five him, and I would say, "Way to go, buddy! Nice work." Yeah, I was All worried right. about it being a little dry because there was nothing on it, um, but it wasn't. It was very moist and, and delicious. I would, if you put a little ketchup on it, it would probably enhance it a little. It would be a little better, but it's good, plain Jane. Um, it's great. It's good but stuff. Let's move on to the. All right, the next one is going to be the straight, straight up. up, straight up. Um, this one's got lettuce tomato uh donkey sauce on there Ooh, donkey um sauce. i think it might be a little onion on there as well so sharon go ahead and have that okay. take a bite of that tell me what you think of that now this one Ooh. i don't know if you're down with those with I'm, that. I'm not a big fan of onion but you know what i'm gonna try it give it a shot girl tell us what um, you think of it yeah. a little messier i like a messy burger okay i'm gonna give this a shot now Mm -hmm. mm. Mm -hmm. Let me make sure I wipe my mouth here. I don't want to be a mess on camera. That's mm. good. That's really, really good. Um, now, if I was to compare the two so far, I would say that it, besides having the lettuce and tomato and onion on it, they're very similar. Um, mm -hmm. I, I, I didn't notice a big difference in those two burgers. I like the addition of the extra stuff, lettuce, tomato. The sauce is good. That's good stuff. All right. The next one we're gonna check out is gonna be the pig patty. This is a burger Let's with a thing with a, it's got a, mm. it's got some donkey sauce on there and it's got bacon, a yeah. patty of literal uh, literally oh a, a patty of bacon. Let's let's show them here when we say a patty. Oh boy. Of bacon. Look at that. Yes, it's got a big old <laughs> patty like of bacon. Big, on. Almost like a it's a hard patty of bacon. Bacon burger. Hold on, like, hold on. We we need to, we need to cleanse our palate really quickly okay. with a fry. Oh, the fries are really good. You need to cleanse right. your palate with a fry. Okay. There you go. There you go. Okay. Mm. All right, give it a shot to that pig patty. Okay, so it's kind of like a bacon burger, I guess you might compare it to. It's more than a, it's the it's got an entire slice. It's got a full patty. It's like a double burger, but one patty is a burger and one is bacon patty. Mm. Oh god, the bacon's really crunchy. Oh yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. That's bacon heaven right there. Mm. Mm. 
that is really good. Now, I, I can definitely sense a little, there's some grease. I mean, the burgers have a little grease to them, right? Just because they're I'm moist. sure, yeah, it's good. they're moist and they have a little um, a grease in them and all that. And that's what you get when you have a, a, a griddle fried, you know, burger type of deal. It's not char broiled. Mm -hmm. I'm getting a little extra grease from, from the bacon um, uh, patty as well. So I'm definitely tasting that. If I'm yeah. being honest, if I'm it's, being honest. It's got some great flavor. That bacon mm. really adds to the flavor. We gotta cleanse my palate. Mm -hmm. All right, now, the next now we one, have... the next one is, has always been my favorite so far, mm -hmm. but to be honest, I haven't tried all the guys' burgers in the past. That's right. So I've always gone with the ringer because I know it came with a little bit of barbecue sauce on it, mm. and I like that flavor. And the onion ring? Yeah, so I've always just said the ringer was my favorite. But so the ringer, so, the, so this one's got, I'm sorry, yeah. the, so this one's got onion ring, uh, lettuce, tomato, a hint of onion on there. It's got barbecue sauce on there as well. Instead of the donkey sauce, it's got the barbecue sauce. All right, so let's give that one a taste and see what you, okay. see what you got going on. It's a little messier. <laughs> That's what we like, a messy oh. burger. There's nothing wrong with a messy and burger. And I made the burgers kind of protruding out of the back there, so let me see. Nothing okay. wrong there. Give it a shot, Sharon. Who doesn't want to see Sharon from Sharon C. Travel eat a big old burger? Did you yeah. get a, Did you even get a bite of, of onion ring on there? Are you sure you did? You did okay. Okay. All right, I'm going in for the kill, guys. So that barbecue sauce is so good. Okay, that one got messy. Mm, mm -hmm. That one got messy. Meanwhile, how great is the service in this carnival ship? But awesome guy come by, seeing if we need to clear any plates out or anything. <laughs> yeah. Unbelievable. Not quite yet, but. <laughs> Mm. Um, soon. Mm. That was good. That was definitely good. Yeah, I'm getting the onion ring, the barbecue, very good. I wonder, that's probably a similar barbecue that when you get um, from uh, the guy's the Pig guy, and Anchor yeah. place. Uh -huh. Same barbecue. <laughs> guy Fieri barbecue sauce. Yeah, very, great. very good on there. All right. Now, okay. now the last but not least, this I've one. Never, I've never tried the Chilius. I've ne literally never Maximus. tried this as well. Mm. The Chilius Maximus. It's got um, an onion ring. It's got chili. It's got a little chili. Let me it's take got, the bun off in the it's middle It's got here. the donkey sauce on there as well, it looks like. Yeah. And it's a cheeseburger. Yeah. So let's check this one out and see what we got. Yeah. And you know, I like that onion ring on there and I've never, um, I like chili, so I might like this one better. I don't this know. This be a new favorite burger. You never know. I'm going to try it. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Yeah. I can get a hint of that, that chili flavor in there. Mm. Mm -hmm. Why am I such a mess when I eat and you're so clean and neat? So yeah, so the difference between the Ringer and the Chili Smaximus is you get a little more of a barbecue flavor with the Ringer mm -hmm. and you get more of that chili, almost like a a little more maybe a Mexican flavor or something with it. Just a mm. chili um, type flavor with the burger. A little more of a spicy deal because yeah, it's got that chili different. on there. Mm -hmm. There's not a ton of chili. And maybe if I, if, I, if I was a big fan of the chili, I might say, hey man, get a little generous with that chili. It was a little light on the yeah. chili, so. But you can smell it. Like when you put boy, it up to good. take a bite, you can kind of smell that chili. All right, so we have each tried a bite of each burger. Um, we're gonna give you our, I guess, let's each give our favorite favorite to least favorite I guess mm -hmm. um, and then we're gonna finish these up we're not gonna leave any wasted food all right since I know everyone wants to know Sharon's information I'll go first because that's like a, a teaser build-up I'll go first no one cares what I think but then you're gonna want to know what Sharon thinks so so for me okay um, go from most favorite to least favorite my most favorite I'm gonna say I'm still a fan of the traditional straight-up burger uh, it's, got, it's a cheeseburger with uh, the sauce, lettuce, tomato, a little onion. I still love that one because I know I can still go to the toppings bar and load it up with anything else I want. So I think for me, that's still my favorite. It's traditional, it's basic, and I like it. My next favorite, I think, I have to say is the ringer because I love that barbecue sauce on that burger with the onion ring. I think my next favorite after that is going to be um, the Chilius Maximus because I'm digging the combination of the chili and the onion ring on there. After that, I'd say, this is gonna this is gonna be a little weird, but after that, I say I'm going plain Jane because it's a basic, good quality cheeseburger. 
And I think my least favorite is gonna be the pig patty, and I'll tell you why. I mentioned it when I was tasting it. A little bit too much of a, uh, a little too much of a grease flavor in there. Not so much, I'm not getting blown out with the bacon, it was a little more grease. So that's me, that's my breakdown. Sharon, what did you think? What was your what was your well, least favorite um, to well, to your favorite? Or your favorite to your least favorite, yeah, whatever okay. way you wanna go. All right, so my ultimate favorite is still the ringer. I love the onion ring on it with the barbecue sauce mm -hmm. um, and hands down, that is my favorite, um, even after trying all of them. So ringer is number one. Now my number two is actually the pig patty. I know that wow. was Jamie's last, but that's my least favorite. I that's know. your number two. It's my number okay. two. Okay. I loved the bacon on it. Um, unlike Jamie, uh, it was crunchy. It had flavor. I really loved that bacon flavor on okay. my burger, and I am going with the pig patty. Pig that's patty number two. two. Okay. Um, number three. Number three, I am going to go with the. I think I'm gonna say the plain Jane. Plain Jane number three. Okay. I'm gonna say plain Jane number three. Um, now, I would probably put some ketchup on my plain Jane and make it a little better, but I'm just gonna go with the plain Jane. Okay. Number, three. number four, I am going to go with the straight up. Okay. Um, Lettuce, tomato, donkey right. sauce, okay, mm -hmm. basic yeah. stuff. But yes, I'm gonna go with um, the straight up for number four. And actually my least favorite. Your least favorite, hold on, done. let me get a drum roll. <laughs> least favorite burger my from Guy's Burger on Carnival Cruise Ships. Is the Chili's Maximus. Wow. You know, I like chili. Shocking. I love chili separately, you know, as a meal, a cup of chili, but um, on my burger, um, I don't know. I. I would definitely eat it. I'm going to definitely probably have another bite or two of it. Um, but if I had to choose, that would be my least favorite. So there you have it. That's it, guys. Yeah. That's the breakdown. We came, we saw, we conquered. We had a burger. We had one of every burger offered at Guy's Burger Joint here on the Carnival Vista. We are in the first Carnival sailing um, out of Galveston, the first post-pandemic Carnival Cruise Line sailing in the U.S. And I will say that um, in the past, the, the burgers... I mean, I know it's been over 15 months, guys, but I definitely do remember that the burgers were a, a little bit smaller and the buns were a smaller bun. These buns are like just big, fluffy buns. Um, big, hulky we buns. We noticed that difference when they brought them out. And I don't know if that's like that on all the ships right mm -hmm. now, if it's just a new bun that they've um, Could be a new bun, a, a, new con a new vendor supplying buns, or maybe or, just for this trip or whatnot. Yeah, so that's what we got for but ours. They are definitely good. It's a nice, big, fluffy burger, um, and you gotta have a guys next time you're on a ship. Yes, and now keep a few things in mind really quick, just as we wrap up. Number one, sometimes what we love to do is we get the guys burger with no bun. Mm -hmm. If you want the flavor, that oh, yeah. guys, but you don't wanna get too full you know, before dinner, because we know you're eating like mm -hmm. a madman on these cruises. And that's um, also a good idea if you're, maybe, you know, you're getting on the ship and maybe you're trying to diet still sure. a little bit. And, and a little you know, low carb, a little keto yeah. or something like that. Mm -hmm. So you can still order the, the guys burger without the bun and just go with the toppings. And they are and that's really fantastic. Delicious. So that's always an option for you as well with any one of these burgers. Turns into a nice little dinner plate. Mm -hmm. So um, that's the scoop. Sharon, have we covered everything here with Guy's Burgers info for we the have, people? except for the fries. The fries, they don't always look the best, but believe me, these fries are the best. Mm. So that's everything from us, guys. From Sharon to Sea Travel to you. Don't forget, before you leave, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit the uh, notification bell so you don't miss any of our cruise-oriented content. Join us on Facebook at Sharon and Sea Cruise Crew. And uh, give a thumbs up to the video if you liked it. And if you're into Guy's Burger, let us know in the comments below. What's your favorite? Yes, what's the best burger uh, at sea? We think it's Guy's Burger. You may find something different. Let us know what's your favorite burger at sea when you go cruising. And until next time, happy cruising, guys. And now we're going to enjoy these burgers. Yes, this food will not be wasted. We're going to eat every part of it. We might go, we might push the buns away a little, but every piece of meat will be consumed by us. We promise you that. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for joining us here today at Sharon as you travel.